Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new video by Rail Suffolk FC in the ISFL Division 3 where you find us at home today against Claydon with me Jason Lewis and me Ben Kedemol. And Let's take a look at the lineups today. You've got myself in between the sticks in goal playing a formation of 4-3-3 with a back four of Darren, Craney, Mossy and Daquan. A midfield three of Carnell, Ash and Mason Rayner. And the strikers today, you've got GC, Smithy and Jermaine. That is a goal lineup, that is. And on the subs bench, you've got Charlie, James and Liam. It's going to be a tough game today for the boys. Playing in our Galatasaray kick, kicking off from right to left today. Claydon, one of the strong teams in the league. They're going for glory in all fronts in the league and the cup. We'll have to be at our absolute best to get anything from this game today. But uh, as you see straight from kickoff, the pressure from the Claydon players is there as they win the ball back. And it's played to the striker and uh, long ball forward. Oh, I've got there. Positive clip for me for once. Oh, that was... As I roll it out quickly to Daquan as we try and get an attack started straight away. But uh, it's a cut out by the right back as he bombs forward down at the right hand side. Low crossing, great block for Daquan. Player here trying to get an early attack so it's into the box. It's up in the air, it's still up in the air. It's come down. I've grabbed it. Oh, well done, Jason. So proud of me. Yeah. Under pressure as well. <laughs> I've got the throw. Got two throws in the game. Normally I'll just go for a long kick, but uh, maybe I'll just start adding pressure to the team. But Darren does really well there to come forward with the ball. He's got past two or three players. Oh, he's done, well he's done, done amazing. Sir. Yes, Good come strength. on, keep it up. Played inside to Smithy. Hits it first oh. time. Oh, just high and wide. That's really good play so far. So come on, Real. Let's keep it up. Darren done really well at bombing forward on that right-hand side as uh, Clayton looked to form an attack. It's a weak shot. Oh, it's met through. by the striker. Oh, 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 he's beat me. I didn't think he was going to get there. It's 1-0 to Clayton. In fairness, it's actually quite a well-worked goal. Um, he found the time. He actually picked up his man, who I think, who I think was onside. I think I think he might have been just onside, and he beat you at the near post. He was quite close, so I can't really fight you. For that. Yeah, I didn't think he was going to win the ball, so I thought I was running on to meet him. But he got a touch in, and uh, to be fair, good finish by the strikers. Carnell tries to get us back into the game. His ball played forward, Smithy. He plays it one more to George. Oh, it's a great oh, tackle by defender. Comes up to Guy though. Passes Shoot. man. Foul. Oh. Is it a penalty? Is it a free kick? It's been it given as like, a free kick. It looks like the ref made the right decision. I think it was right on the edge, nice but a lot of our players aren't happy with that decision. And here is yeah. that free kick. You can see it's right, right on, on the, the edge. edge. I think that is the right decision. Smithy, we know he can hit a ball with power. Can he find the goal on the eighth minute here to get it leveled on terms with Clayton? He hits it under the wall, just wide. Good effort, my boy. Trying to apply more pressure now as it's a throw in by Daquan to Smithy. He does well to hold up the ball. It's fine, Carnell. It bubbles about to Jermaine. Swivels can he comes turn? out. No. He turns. Great can turn. He get the shot off. Plays it back to Ash, who comes out wide here to Daquan. Good pressure from the boys. Gets past oh, his man really well, well there. Done. What's the delivery like? It's a good ball in. Little comes bit out too to, wide. Is it Mason on this far side? He finds Smithy at the back post. Takes a touch, comes inside, plays across the... Oh, it's bobbling oh, around. Oh! Hit the top corner. Bobbling that was a pretty there. good play, though, by Real. Get the pressure on. Oh, and they're back on the pressure again. It's Carnell pressing towards the bottom. Oh, it's a great oh, interception so by the defender. So unlucky there. It's, it's the right play. thing to do, though. It's a ball down the wing. Daquan does well to cut it out himself as well. But, uh, back forward, the ball comes. Digs it forward to Smithy. It's a great touch. He's made it. He's hit it. Oh, it's a goal kick to Clayden. 23 minutes into the game, we're still piling on the pressure, trying to find a breakthrough, trying to find an equaliser. And uh, it's great play there by the striker. He plays it across goal. Yes. Oh, it's hit the post. It's an awkward angle, to be fair. 
Oh, and it's kept it well in. Well kept in by Mason. Let's get the ball back in the box quickly. It's a great cross in. But nothing comes from it. 25th minute now. Clayton have a free kick just inside the Rouse Suffolk half as it's lift, lofted into the box. It's me again. Nice and easy. I'm liking these clips. Another rollout. And uh, to look to try and perform another attack. Mossy here with the ball. One of our new players. It's a great ball down the line. Oh, oh it's a beautiful ball. It's Mason. Ball. He's in and he's bursting into the box. Gets past the man with a great bit of skill. Looks for his options. Oh, there's no one there again. That's the problem with this game. He's gone for the header. It's oh. come out to nobody. Shoot. Carnell. Oh. Oh. He did the right thing. He shot on first instinct. A little bit too high. Bodies in the box. That's the problem. Half an hour into the game, Clayton, I think they had a corner, enough of comfort, but it's come back to the crosser on the right hand side as he got to the byline. It's a bit of bobbling around all over the place as it comes up to the edge of the box. He's hit it. I've oh, saved yeah. it. Whoever the edit is, I'm so pleased they've put quite a lot of my highlights in. 35th minute now as Clayton have a free kick on the far side. It's a good aim, it's a good distance away, potential shots. There's a wall of two men. It's just lofted in, it's bounced. It's fumbled oh, and it's found it's, its way in. in. I'm now not liking these highlights. It's 2-0 yeah, to Clayton. Yeah, Jason, I think because it's from so far away, I think you really need to be catching this or pushing this away. I know it does bounce beforehand, but you push it into the feet Poor. of the striker. The striker's on his own on, as well, though, which doesn't help. It just finds its way in the net, so maybe... You could have done better there, in my opinion. <laughs> Fourteenth minute now, as uh, Hayden got a stronghold on the game against the run of play, if I do say. But uh, it's a long ball forward. Oh, it's the striker. He's one on one. He's. Oh. Oh, you can see me in the red in the background, turning my back with disgust on that. Um, yeah, it's a fantastic ball. He's just not picked up by the defence. He's a big guy. I'm in no man's land. And you run forward to confront him. Probably the wrong decision. Well, I didn't want to run into him. Look at the size of him. Well, just stay on your goal line. <laughs> you can't be loved it anyway. It's 3-0. <laughs> it's not looking good for the boys. We need to just try and keep oh, our good heads ball, up. Though. Oh. He's picked his pocket. Come Is on. not foul? No. George has done really well there. Gets to the byline. He's gone for goal. Oh, hit the post again. The boys just not getting the luck of this game. It's the third time they've hit the post in this half. Could have been 3-3. Free free. It's got oh, it's hit Chris's car. He won't be happy about that. 45th minute now as uh, the half comes to a close. There's a poor pass. It's really oh. poor. Oh, oh, look at that. You finally got Outside that. of the foot. Look at that for a ball. The boy's got it. But uh, Clayton win it back there in their own half. It's a, again, a ball for us. Well cut out by Ash. Comes out to Carnell. Just misses out there. But that is it for a half. It is half time. 3 0 to Clayton. They're chasing the title. But Ben, what were your thoughts? Well, so far, I do believe Clayton are worthy to be in front. However, Real have hit the post three times. Mm. They have had positives, so football is a cruel sport, but maybe in the second half they might be able to claw something back based like, on this performance. I feel like we deserve something from that half, and we are, we are unlucky to find ourselves 3 0 down against the league leaders. But uh, as Clayden get us underway for the second half, but uh, let's see if the boys can salvage something from this. We've hit, as you say, we hit the post three times. I'm sure we can find the back of the net three times, but uh, as we get the game underway, it's. Uh, Cut out well there by Mossy. Plays it forward um, to take and tries to do it, but it's gone out for a throw in on that far side. Um, and nothing came from that. But we can reach the 62nd minute in the game as the winger gets to the byline. It's crossed in, it's fumbled by a few players. It's uh, hit, it's hit a massive deflection on Mossy. It's 4 0. I was wrong footed. Again, it's just unlucky. That's true. You know, you know, I can't really fault you or the defence for this. Um, because it just takes a wicked deflection. You were probably going to save that if it had not I like been the interfered confidence. with. I like the confidence. 68th minute now as uh, GC takes the corner on that far side. Oh, oh my God. word! 
Well away to score your first goal for Real Suffolk. George Connor. What a man. What a goal. Well, you know, if you can't score your goals from open play, you may as well score them direct from a corner. He said, we've been unlucky this game. That's a slice of luck that we needed. What a goal. Come on, the boys. Let's see if we can get our way back into the game. It's going to be a long shot now in the 81st minute as Clayton again. Look to... uh, There's no pressure. It's... Oh, oh, it's been piled in. I don't know what happened there. A lack of pressure from the from the players and it's a simple finish on the goal line. Yeah, I think that might have been hit a bit like towards you, was it? I think it, it hits me there. It hits you and again, you didn't deal with it Double cup. correctly. You should have just It's a poor goal out. all round. He should have been on his own in the six-yard box. But uh, as we approach the night now, it's 5-1 to Clayton. They're seeing this game out. But uh, as the ball play forward, as they come into the box, played inside... They're just passing it around now. See, they've got plenty of players back. But uh, we can't clear it properly. And there's too many men that are being unmarked. It comes out to that far, hand, far side where the ball is lofted in. It's met by the header. Oh, what a save. Oh, oh it's gone in. Six. No, that actually is your best save of the game. Unfortunately, it's marred by the fact there was a striker <laughs> sitting three yards away. But again, let, let, let's just see this save because it was fantastic. Header comes in, boom, very fast reactions. So it's straight onto the striker's feet. I do have to give you credit for that. Again, it comes Good down save. to luck. If I'd have got a bit more on it, I'll go over the bar. But anyway, Ben, game's over, what do you think? I think it's fair to say Clayton, they're the league leaders. They're trying to go in for the title. They fully deserve this win. Good luck to them. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.